Storm Team 4 coverage now feeling a little bit more like fall today, although still gorgeous conditions. And meteorologist Kristen Kershane has a check on our forecast. Tons of sunshine outside today. We're not going to see much in the way of cloud cover. And as we take a look at a couple of our sky cameras here, you can see all of that sunshine. Really nice looking outside. A little bit cooler, though, compared to the last few days. The last two afternoons, we made it into the 70s. Today, we will top out into the 60s. And as we check in on current temperatures now, it's a mix of 50s and low 60s. For areas close to the coastline, we're already starting to see temperatures coming down, and that's due to a lake breeze that's starting to kick in. We were at 63 in Milwaukee. Now the temperature down to 61. As we check in on our wind direction here, that helps tell the story. Winds coming in out of the north for our inland locations, but look close to the coast here, Milwaukee, Racine, you can see those winds out of the northeast. So that's that lake breeze starting to set in. The water temperature only in the 40s right now, and so that's bringing in some cooler air for areas close to the water. Across the state, you can see no rain to talk about and confirming what we saw on the cameras there. No cloud cover, and it's not a much different story as we back up the view and take a look at the big picture across the region. High pressure continuing to build in for us here. That means clear skies as we finish out the rest of the day. Again, the flow around this area of high pressure turning those winds off the lake. So one of those days where we say cooler by the lake. As we look towards tomorrow, though, the setup changes quite a bit. Our winds come in out of the southwest, and that's going to bring in some much warmer air for us. Friday afternoon, high temperatures making it into the mid upper 70s. I wouldn't be too surprised if a few places make it to about 80 degrees. It will be windy though Friday afternoon gusts up around 40 miles an hour. A front comes through as we head into uh, late Friday night, early Saturday. The front doesn't bring any rain. It does change the wind direction a bit though, so we'll be a little cooler as we head into the weekend, right around 70 on Saturday, 60s for the second half of the weekend. Our next chance for rain moves in on Monday, so it's been a while since we've seen any significant rain here. We could certainly use the rain. Looks like it's going to arrive as we start next week. Here's a look as far as the precipitation numbers for the month of October. Uh, we haven't seen a whole lot of rain here. We're about a half inch behind compared to normal for 2020 as a whole, though. We've seen over 34 inches of precipitation, and that's six inches ahead of normal. Today, uh, 66. We already topped out at our high, though, this afternoon. It looks like for Milwaukee, inland areas will likely still see a few more degrees uh, added on to those temperatures. But lots of sunshine today and not so much wind to deal with this afternoon. Dinner time tonight, temperatures will be into the 60s, depending on where you are. If you're close to the water, they'll be in the 50s. Overnight, we're down to about 50 degrees. Winds starting to pick back up. And again, Friday will be a windy day for us, but very warm, feeling a bit like summer. 70 on Saturday, 60s on Sunday. We'll stay dry over the weekend. Again, rain moves in for us on Monday and could see some lingering showers into Tuesday. That's your forecast. All right. Thank